Forget your motivation. What's up, champ? Hope you're having a great day. I just got off the phone with uh, a potential student of mine. He's a professional dancer who has been dancing professionally for over a decade. I don't want to mention any names. Bashata dancer. Incredible. Probably one of your favorite dancers, to be honest with you. And um, she came off the phone, or we, we got on the phone and we started talking uh, ups and downs. She had these goals that she's been wanting to, to go after for years. Some physical goal, a lot of mental goals. Um, of course, some very dance specific goals, wanting to do different acrobatics, different, um, different things in life. But what she told me is something that I hear so frequently. I hear it so frequently and it really bothers me. It really, really bothers me to, to, to keep hearing this because I feel that a lot of us dancers and a lot of people in general have been sold something. We have been sold a dream and it's holding us back. And I promise you that once you understand this concept on almost like a, almost on a deeper level, once you understand this concept on a deeper level, you're gonna get so much more out of life. Like for you to reach your goals is gonna be so much faster so I talked to this dancer, we run over where she wants to go, we run over where she has, what type of things she's been training before, we run over her goals, and then I ask her like, okay champ, but um, what are the things that are holding you back right now? Like why haven't you been able to, to get there before? And she tells me, ah, I'm just not motivated. And I said, uh, because I've been hearing this excuse so much, like it almost triggers something in me right now. It's like, wait, what, what do you mean? You, you're not motivated? What, is, what does that mean? It's like, yeah, I want, to, I want to get that dream body of mine. I want to get uh, mentally stronger. I want to win this big competition in Bashata. But uh, I'm just not motivated. Well, motivation, like, that's a feeling. Motivation is a feeling. So what you're telling me is that you are not acting on your goals when you are not feeling like it. And just let that sink in for a little bit, like the power of that statement. Because you, let's say this then, would you go to work if you were sad? Would you go to work if you were happy? Would you feed your children if you were feeling confused? I mean, your feelings can't determine your actions. It, it makes no sense. It really makes no sense. Like, do you truly believe that every person out there, every person in the world wakes up being motivated? Every fit person in the world, or every professional dancer, or every person that you look up to who has a strong mindset, do you really believe that they wake up motivated? Motivation is a fairy tale. It's a fairy tale. It's really a fairy tale that Hollywood has shown you. You know, you see, look at, look at Rocky, you know? <laughs> this guy, he has all the setbacks in the world. He has to sell his fucking dog or something. And then all of a sudden he wakes up early in the morning. He takes a few raw eggs. You hear the music. He puts them in a the blender. He drinks them. Then he goes on a morning run. The music starts. He keeps running. Uh, runs up these stairs and uh, shadow box, beautiful music, and then all of a sudden he wins. But that's not the, <laughs> that's the fairy tale, champ. That's not what it is. That's not what this is. That's not what, that's not what winners do. That's not how you win in life. Trust me, that's not how you win in life. If you're gonna rely on the illusion of motivation, I promise you right now, you're going to fail. I promise you right now. If you want to become, let's say you want to become a better math teacher, you are going to fail if you are going to rely on motivation. You need discipline. I said this so many times before. I said this so many times before. Before persistency, before uh, the skill of, uh, of whatever, of the skills that you want, you need discipline. In order for you to get what you want out of life, you have to do what you got to do when you're supposed to do it, whether you feel like it or not. That's how you get there. 
It's discipline. It's not motivation. Champ, if you if you believe in motivation, you're gonna you're gonna fall. I said it before. Motivation is like a blue moon. It's a it's a it's a unicorn. It comes out whenever you know. When it's there, you gotta act. But if you're not motivated, you got to rely on your discipline. That's, that's what's gonna get you there. If you believe, if you have the illusion in your head that you're gonna get anything out of life and you're gonna rely on motivation, you are going to fail. I wouldn't be able to build this business. I wouldn't be able to work remote for the last two years. I wouldn't be able to train dancers professionally for the last six years. I wouldn't be able to be a professional dancer myself for the last 12 years if I didn't have discipline. I promise you, I'm not motivated. I'm not a motivated individual. That's the biggest illusion. That's the biggest lie. It's an easy lie to sell. Because some of you guys, you, we, or it's not even you, I'm, myself included. Some of us, we go on, we go online and we just search for that motivation, that motivational video, that motivational video that gives you like a spark. It's like a sugar high. Gives you an illusion of like, wow, I looked at a motivational video, you feel something. Maybe you take a little action on it. And then the day after the motivation is gone. But that's not what's going to get you to reach your movie ending. I promise you, it's not what's gonna get you to reach that movie ending. And I get so sad when I hear it. I get so sad when I hear like professional dancers talking about they, they are not where they want to be in life, but they believe that they, there's got to be a feeling for them to get there. That's not what this is about. That's not what this is about. It's discipline. It's discipline over everything. Discipline over everything. Motivation is a fairy tale. But it won't get you there, I promise you. Don't go for the motivational video. It's good every once in a while, you know? It's good every once in a while for you to get there, to get that spark, to have that mu mu music playing in the background. But it's you. You are the one in control. You are the one who, you and only you, are going to decide where you want to be in life. And if that's number one, that's on you. Uh, but, and it takes sacrifice. It takes a ton of sacrifice, make no mistake about it. But if you want to be number three, four, five, that's also on you. It also takes sacrifice. And I believe it takes equally as much sacrifice to be number five as it takes to become number one. I believe it takes equally as much, just in different areas. Just in different areas. The sacrifice is the same. The amount of sacrifice is the same. Just in different areas of your life. Are you sacrificing on your dreams? Or are you sacrificing on Netflix marathon, parties, hanging around with friends? It's up to you, Sham. But discipline is what's gonna get you there. And I had that conversation with the dancer. I had that long conversation with the dancer. Hopefully she got it. Hopefully she got it. She got a little bit offensive. She got a little, little bit uh, offended almost from what I said. And some of you guys might be feeling offended right now. But good. <laughs> if, you're feeling the, uh, de uh, if you're feeling defensive and offended for what I'm saying, it's because you know I'm right. Because you know I'm right. This channel, me, my coaching is not for you if you believe that I'm going to give you motivation all the time. That's not why I'm here. That's not why I'm here. I'm here to tell you what you need to hear. And you need to understand that in order for you to get what you want to get out of life, you got to do what you are supposed to do, when you're supposed to do it, whether you feel like it or not. That's what discipline is. You got to put in the work, champ. It's that simple. Go. Do it. Stop this video. You know what you should be doing. You know what you should be doing right now. Stop this video, go and take action on your goals. All right? Buy Dances for Dancers.